San Diego is known for a lot of things. Our beaches, Balboa Park, and usually the sun. But June gloom is in full swing right now, coming after a dreary May gray. It is official. San Diego was the cloudiest city in the continental U.S. last month. Good evening and thanks so much for joining us on another gloomy day. I'm Marcella Lee. Meteorologist Sean Stiles looks at the reasons for gloomageddon and sees if there is any sunshine in San Diego's future. Sean? As San Diegans, we're used to May gray and June gloom, but let's get real. This is a little much. In fact, an article just released said that downtown San Diego was the cloudiest city in the lower 48 for the month of May. For the month of May in San Diego, we had 18 days that were mostly cloudy to cloudy. Alex Tardy is a meteorologist for the National Weather Service here in San Diego. The sun might have briefly come out a couple of those days, but most of the day was cloudy. That means San Diego had nearly 35% more overcast conditions for the month of May. Gloomageddon. We normally have 11, so that's seven more days. And if you think the sun was missing for the city of San Diego, you were right. We had no days, zero, that were clear. There's always clouds hanging around every single day. Normally we have about four days, even in May, that are clear. What did that mean for the average temperatures? The answer to the question is yes, nighttime and daytime, and our total temperature was below average. Tardy says blame it on the weather pattern not changing. Uh, so, so the jet stream didn't retreat as much as it normally does. Ocean temperatures got down to 52 degrees in April in La Jolla. You add in weak storms okay. moving through the and area, the and the you week. have a deeper marine layer that's more widespread and harder to burn off. That pattern looks to last through the 15th. 10 days from now, and we do finally see a little change, this big H. But there is hope on the horizon. If that can win out and shift to the west coast, we could finally see a pattern change with more sun, much warmer conditions. And as Alex said, these low pressures will keep marching through, but come the mid part of June, there is a little bit of light at the end of the tunnel. Let's just hope it's sunshine. We'll send it back to you in the studio.